You know what gets me excited? When somebody drives in front of one of our projects and actually gets out of the car and starts taking pictures. And you do that by not making it look like a rental, you do that by making it look like a new build. Welcome to the Furtado Group. I'm Ruben Furtado and you're watching our Two Minute Tuesday. This is where we actually take our clients' floor plan ideas, exterior elevations, and we actually tweak them. And what we try to do in every single case is really maximize the sale value of that project, but at the same time using strong design to reduce the cost of construction, ultimately to keep more money in your pocket. In today's design, we're actually gonna be taking a floor plan that we did from last week, and now we're gonna be looking at the elevation drawings, and we're gonna actually transform this house that actually would look like a rental. If anybody drove by, they would assume it would have been a rental, but we're doing something different. We're actually gonna spend a little bit more money and we're actually gonna make it look like a brand new build. And this is where the game changer is because anybody who's driving by will be wowed by this house and they're gonna actually wanna stop, get out of the car and take pictures. But let's get started. So this is what the house looks like right now. And you can see, it looks pretty decent. I don't know about that one tree there on the left-hand side though, that one's gotta come down. But either way, this is what we're working with. And now you're gonna see what the architect came back with. Intention here, was to actually try to make, give the height, some height to this house. And you're gonna see he did that by removing the covered porch and then basically creating more of a vertical lines with brick and then some siding down the center portion here. And then now the garage only really has a covered section just over the garage. So here's what we're gonna do to really change this up. So very first thing, I wanna elongate it and I wanna make it look taller. That's a tall order, right? But check this out. What if we were to, to make it long, if we were to take these two windows, right, and we actually make them feel like one large curtain wall. So a curtain wall is basically a window that is structural, that actually has support in it. So we're gonna make this window come down to the floor, this window right to the ceiling, and then we're gonna add, our windows are gonna be black frames, we're gonna add a black mullion to make that look like one solid piece, right? But now to give this the length horizontally, what I wanna do, is we're gonna get rid of this, the top of this garage. Imagine that going away. And then what we're gonna do, and this is my favorite part, is we're actually gonna add this feature over the front door, so that the cover, we're gonna add that covered porch area all the way across the garage, and it's gonna look like an L all the way across, just like that. And then this is gonna be done in black aluminum. Okay, you guys can kind of picture that. Okay, and because the person doing this renovation, he's a masonry guy, all this brick here in the front, and then this siding that's here, we're actually gonna do this in a really nice stone. So this will all be all done like in a really nice stone. And we're gonna change the front entrance. Now, to reduce the cost, because remember, this is all about making this a project profitable, where he was gonna do all this other stuff, we're gonna save some money, and we're gonna actually make this all stucco up here across the top. And we're gonna create some reveals in the stucco, right? Across here, and here, and here. So now what we have is this longer shape um, part of the house here with this taller shape sitting on top. Now, cost-wise, it's not gonna increase the cost much because well, number one, we were gonna have to redo this roof anyway, and we we're gonna redo this roof. So if we're gonna redo this roof, let's just change the roof entirely, and now we're just gonna do asphalt shingles on the top. And I'm gonna tell you, when somebody drives by this house now, it's gonna look more like this image that I'm showing you right now. And at the same time, it will not look like a renovation. It's gonna look like something that was built from the ground up. And the incremental cost that was spent on here is a fraction to how much more we're gonna be selling the house. So that's a wrap for today's video, guys. If you watched it to the end, I wanna thank you. And also at the same time, this has to be something that's gotta be of interest to you. So if you guys haven't already been following us on Instagram, be sure to check us out at the Furtado Group. You're gonna get a lot more information there. Also, if you guys want us to maybe the next two minute Tuesday, we're gonna be reviewing and tweaking possibly your plans. You gotta let us know, you gotta send them in. So either send us a comment below or actually go to our Instagram account and send us a direct DM and we'll be sure to reach out to you because we'd love to actually work on your specific project. Till next time guys, take care.